Hello there and welcome to this Accelerator Studio tutorial where I will be talking about a different way that you can make your user navigate in your application. It's called a scroll view and it works the way that, uh, let me just draw it over here, the user uh, can see a window and can either swipe it left or right to get to another window. Um, and you'll see uh, on Android you'll get some arrows here that shows what direction you can go. And on iOS you will have a bar down here with uh, some circles in it. One of the circles will be marked so you can see where in the application you are. And then you can swipe to a direction to navigate. So that's what we are going to do. We are going to create three views um, because the difference between using Windows and a scrollable view is that a scrollable view uses views instead uh, to navigate with. Um, but of course we need to create a window that the scrollable view can be in. So the first thing we're going to do is create a window, like usually. ti.ui.i create window. Just leave it like that. Then we are going to create a scrollable view. Scrollable view. ti.ui.create scrollable view. And we'll, we're going to add some properties to it later, but not, not for now. So we have the scrollable view. We need to create three views that can be inside the scrollable view. One that is black, one that is gray, and one that is white. Okay, so we create three views. We create one called view white equals ci.ui.create view. Set the background color to white. And you do it with the two others just with grey and black, or any other color you like. Grey and black. And of course remember to change the color here. Grey and black. Right. So to tell the scrollable view that we're going to use view white, view grey and view black, we simply set up the property of views. You, do a, you put it inside an array so you write all the necessary views that you want to add. View white, comma, view gray, and view black. Then you add the scrollable view to the view to the window. Blah, blah. Scrollable view. And of course open the window. Let's save that and see how it looks. You see we have this white window here. When we drag it right we get to the view's second view and the black view here. Um, so just just uh, another way, a bit more modern way to navigate your app than just opening the window. Um, if you want to show the arrows here, as I talked about, there's a property called show. Uh, let me just show paging control. It needs to be set to true if you want to show the arrows. As you can see, we get an arrow here. Uh, they can also be used for navigating, so you can actually click them instead, uh, which some users find uh, quite useful. But thank you for watching, now you've learned a new way to navigate your app, and I hope to see you in the next episode. Bye bye.